Hello stalkers and welcome to another video. So a lot of viewers asked me if I can show them some mods that can help with the performance of the game. But not only I'm going to show you some of these mods that will improve the game performance. I will also show you some tips on how to increase your FPS dramatically. Let's start with a few mods first which can help you with more performance. So the first mod is Anomaly 1K Performance Texture Pack. So this is a texture pack that you can install with Mod Organizer 2. It's very simple, it's just a folder with a texture pack. The textures of the game are actually a bit higher than HD. So with this texture pack you can lower the quality of the ground, sky and objects to HD quality. This will also affect the gun textures, so keep that in mind. Now this is useful if your graphic card has a low VRAM capacity because the textures will take a lot less space on your graphic card. You will see a lot less shattering and you will also get better loading times. Also this should improve your FPS in places with a lot of vegetation and buildings. Next we have a 3 in 1 combo mod that does 3 things that can improve your FPS. 3x performance tweaks has 3 mods that change the weather to be always a bit foggy because fog will lower the view range and therefore increase your FPS. Then you also have another mod which removes some of the spots for the eye to spawn. That, so basically less stalkers will occupy some of the areas. Then you also have an a life switcher which hides stalkers and mutants that are too far away from you and then makes them appear once you are close enough around 350 meters, which is the same length as the fog distance. Now I don't use this 3-in-1 combo mod because I love sniping up to 600 meters range and I love scouting and spotting things from afar, but if you are struggling with FPS then you should give this 3 mods a try. Now the next mod is very simple, it's a BAS 1K texture performance which lowers the textures of all BAS guns and makes it so it doesn't overload your card's VRAM. Very similar to the 1K Anomaly Texture Pack which I showed you earlier, now the thing is some BAS weapons have 4K textures and even if you select the lowest texture settings in the Docker Anomaly Launcher, they will still be in 4K, which can cause some stuttering and long loading screens in the game. I do sometimes use this mod especially in warfare mode when you got squads of stalkers continuously spawning and fighting. You will see a little bit of a difference texture wise especially if a weapon has markings on the side. Well stalkers we are halfway through this video so make sure to drop a like and subscribe if you're new to my content. I do a lot of stalker anomaly and gamma guides and I love testing new bots and show them to the stalker community. Now let me show you some in-game settings that you can use to boost your FPS dramatically. First of all load the game and go to visuals and advanced. Scroll down a little bit and you'll find distance shadow culling, make sure it is on as this option optimizes the shadows of the game and improves FPS. Another thing that you can do is find rendering quality and turn off some of the options like anti-aliasing and SMAA by lowering anti-strophic filter to just one. Another two options that will affect FPS is the sun ray mode option. You can use screen space mode instead of volumetric and this will remove the annoying sun rays which by the way don't look very realistic in 2024. Also if your FPS drops during rainfall you might want to disable wet surfaces option down in the effects options at the very bottom of advanced tab. When you change these specific settings you have to press apply and restart your game. When you test your FPS and performance always test them in the same location so that you can test and be consistent. Another option which tanks the FPS is the mask overlay of the game. 
if you go to the visual and player options you will see the mask overlay options turn them off you, it will also help you gain more fps i sometimes turn this option off because i don't like the blurriness it adds to the screen and it can affect the quality of your streaming and content now if you want more fps you can also turn off the sun shadows open your console while you are playing in the game and type r2 underscore sun off this will turn off all the sun shadows giving you a huge fps boost this is especially useful in red forest when the sun shadows create a massive fps lag i hope you stalkers found this video useful if you have any questions about the mods or options write down here below in the comments i have a lot more exciting content for stalkers so make sure to subscribe and follow me on youtube bye and thank you for watching